Well, hello again, everybody. Welcome back to the third uh, collab in this latest batch. We have, well, the fourth, actually. Uh, we've reviewed the two Dalek films. We've done a little news thing. And we're going to finish off uh, this, this batch by just sticking with the Dalek, staying in that mindset, and thinking about all the different Dalek designs over the years, or at least the ones I've got the figures of, because I haven't <laughs> got the figures of all of them yet. History of the Daleks, please hurry up. Yes. Um, yeah, but basically, yeah, we just thought, because obviously, you know, the Daleks in the films look so good, and um, we're just in a Dalek mood, really. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. We, we thought we'd go through like the, all the main designs, uh, maybe picking out like little ancillary bits along the way, little one-offs, um, and sort of discuss our favourites, and possibly end up at a point where we're sort of picking our absolute favourite, I suppose, favorite. or yeah, like top yeah. three or whatever. I don't yeah. know, we'll just see how we go. Yeah. Um, so let's just get straight into it, really. Um, First, I mean, I love this display. It's so great, isn't it? It's, isn't it? Look, it, isn't it good? It reminds me of like all those um, like the sound effects Dalek like waves. Yes. You know, the yeah, yeah. And you have all these different designs together. Weirdly, with the drone Dalek so nice. there, it put yeah. me in the mind of like in 2013. I'm sure there was a Dalek poster with all like the Asylum Daleks uh, on it, and it sort of ah, okay. reminds me of that kind of yes. that kind of look. I think yeah. seeing that with that. But yeah, no, the the first the, ones, the, yeah, the OGs. Um, the OGs yeah. got some of the sound effects one there. Yeah, um, I mean, it, it's very tough to to beat it. It is. I, I, I do I do love the the old one. Mm. I think color color wise, I've always liked the sixties color scheme the best um, yeah. because it's just something so simple. You know what? I never know why they went for the blue. I wonder why blue was chosen mm. as a colour. I think it was just to do with how it came up on camera, maybe. Sure, I, think, yeah. isn't it? I just like wonder why it was never black or, yeah. you know, like, <laughs> like a, d a different yeah. kind of colour. Red or green or yeah. something. Yeah. Um, Interesting. But it works. Mm. It works nonetheless. Oh, yes. um, obviously, we had slight variations when they turned up in um, Magician's Apprentice, and it was the... Yeah, well, like the blue bands. The blue bands, round, yeah. basically, yeah. isn't it? Like the midsection uh -huh. and uh, things like that. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I guess the one thing they, they lack, perhaps, is a sense of... I guess back then that the Dalek stories weren't well. It was like set after a big war, uh, like the first Dalek yeah. story, wasn't it? So like, I guess it's, it's not until the latest like, later Dalek stories where you you need them to look a bit more built for war, perhaps a bit more bulky. Mm. Um, but yeah, you know. Yeah, because I still don't get the chrono chrono chronology of how that works. <laughs> God, so who knows? Yeah, who yeah. knows? If you know, let us know in the comments. Yeah. But yeah, so we had that. We had the, the bigger bases, obviously, in Dalek Invasion of Earth. Mm. Um, we were sort of saying in the review we did, weren't we, for the, the film version of that, that the bumpers work better here, the larger bumpers. Um, not so much on the TV props. I mean, they're, they're okay for what they are, but I think... They work nicer when it's just... Just like the one just base. Just the one base. Because really? like, yeah. they have that weird thing where they, they keep the thin base on and then add the bumper on mm. top. And it's just like. Why? Yeah, <laughs> why? <laughs> exactly. But I mean, yeah. these guys, well, just to give them a, br a brief uh, mention as well, yeah. um, are fantastic. Uh, I mean, Oscar, Mono Supreme, um, who obviously I went to the BFI event with, has pointed out to me that the, the colours of these aren't, aren't quite accurate to what we see on screen. <laughs> you know, it's, it's a lot more sort of toy colours like baby blues and I, stuff I love, I love how the, the sculpted in that plastic it just puts me in the days it reminds me of the days when I used to get like Thompson the Tank trains and they were all yes. like, sculpted oh in plastic oh my god yeah, uh, yeah. I, I just love them yeah. I, I think they're just so good mm. and like for years I've I've like I like sort of mixed stuff around in terms of the figures I've got sure. on my shelf mm. um, and the Mechanist Dalek is just or, I mean, call it Mecha style. It's, it's a movie dark, isn't it? Yeah, no. Uh, it's, it's always, <laughs> always been out there yeah. because it just pops. The colours are just fantastic. Mm. The, the big dome lights, no They're wonder lovely, the yeah. new series uh, ones yes. got influenced by mm. that because uh, they just they just really stand out. They look so good. Um, I mean, yeah, I, already in this sort of talk through I, right, I, you yeah. can tell that the contender for this yeah one of the top spots perhaps um, yeah. because and, and the way they, they change the colour scheme for the the red uh, commander and, and the, the black one the, the black one with the, with the alternating spheres of mm -hmm. gold silver gold silver it just yeah yeah I mean we, we said this already today but they, they pop so much like, especially mm -hmm. the first film don't they these, these movie Daleks and they mm. look so solid as well like mm, yes. I don't know why why yeah. that is because 
like why do those props are the same the exact same props mm. but they look more sturdy i guess it is just ones. that that extra height and a thing yeah. as well of like over the years i think was it the original dalek designer who looked at the bronze ones and said why have they got all these like nuts and bolts and things on them like you can tell it's like they've been made from earthly materials yeah. whereas with these because you don't know i suppose yeah. the paradigm as well to a certain extent because you don't have those rivet, like seam lines stuff, or whatever yeah. you, they look more impenetrable i suppose mm-hmm. um but yeah, so so cool, so sixties, so amazing. Yeah. So, shout out to those guys, and we yeah. might come back to those uh, at the end. I think very probably. Um, but yeah, so after that, then we had we've got Chase Dalek here, obviously, with the introduction of the slats. It's sort of one of those, those weird things that when I was a kid, or whatever, I didn't necessarily notice that there was even a difference between these guys knows, until yeah. I, I looked at them and think, oh, actually, yeah, okay, mm-hmm. fair enough. The story reason being that, in the contrast yes. to this. Uh, <laughs> But then that messes things up when you get to Genesis and they've already got the slats. Like, why would they lose them? And uh, yeah, of course, day. yes. Don't bear uh. thinking about <laughs> too much. Out of those two, what do we think? I the best better. One? A lot of people would say the the second one, the one in the mm. middle, because you know it's got yeah. the addition of the slats. Uh-huh. I I think now I, 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 yeah thing, maybe maybe influenced by the movie because it's you know they've they've not got the slats in that yeah well, that's the first true. one at least that's true yeah. Yeah, um, I think I'm, I'm with you there. Yeah, yeah, I think the the original Scaro Dalek has always been mm-hmm. kind of the one, really, proven by the fact that it's the one that that's come back, really, like in the Magician's course, Defense yes. and things like. Yeah. They didn't they didn't bring back one of the slats they brought back. So there you go. There you go. So that's, that's for um, it. the the 60s based done dust room. We had yeah. a little variants and things along the way. Emperor's Guard, Dalek, things like that. The, the Emperor Dalek himself, obviously. Yeah, um, yeah. Just, See, I love I do love the Emperor Guards. I love the, the simple yeah. thing of the black dome. That's, that's very nice. That really yeah. works. Yeah. yeah. But so um, yeah, then we move into the 70s, I suppose. So we've got here one of the um, one of these ones. Oh, it's one of those. <laughs> it's one of those. Oh, yeah. I've never actually seen. Oh, yeah. Okay. No. Oh, yeah. How is it? <laughs> That's so cool. I mean, you've got the thing on the back, but I, mean, yeah, I don't, even, so, I don't yeah. even care. I think the main thing is that it just does that. That's so that's so cool. um, you've got a mutant inside it as well. Yeah. That's They're the Daleks there. And I mean, they they stay similar-ish. Well, basically throughout the 70s, I mean, they're, they're like different shades of grey, aren't they? Um, yeah, like the more, more metallic even when mm. they first start. And, and I the, love um, the figures. And the oval too. as well, of course. And the yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. The look. Yeah, um, um, I mean, the, do you remember yeah, the, I mean, the day of the Daleks ones, when they came out as figures, you you realise how how metallic they were yeah, in metallic. comparison to the, uh, the Genesis. To the Genesis. And, mm, and it, um, it's such a great look for them. Yeah, I mm. think that they definitely, they work so well. For that mm. um you can see why they kind of went with that color scheme yeah i wonder who who i mean i wish i knew more about like the thought process behind these things like the colors and things and, and yeah like why they them. why they switched up from this um mm. i mean i guess it was like their first color appearance on tv so yeah, i suppose so, that would have had something to do with, do but, with it but, but like <laughs> your first color appearance on tv and they're like should we paint them gray yeah yeah <laughs> It's oh, just it, it's, yeah. it's odd, isn't it? But I suppose you have got the gold guy, though. the gold one. Yes, that, that's so this is the uh, the one that's technically inaccurate, but it still looks very nice. Yeah, I mean, um, I I loved room. that when I was yeah. growing up. Like I, I always loved having that. I mean, I, I've definitely got like since yeah, since they came out in history of the Daleks, definitely a new fan appreciation for mm. for those two really. Yeah, uh, like, particularly alongside each other and on the shelf. I, you know, I have the, the gold supreme flanked by one of these guys yeah. either side, which just looks that's fantastic. So good. Yeah. 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 I've, got, I've even noticed the new eye stalk for this as well. That's like yes. a, the four discs. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's, of course, that's, um, it's not Day of the Darks, it's Planet of the Darks, isn't it, those guys? But yes. It's yeah, yeah, for the ones. Same, yeah. same difference. Yeah. yeah. And the frosted sort of mini Cooper lights. On, yes. Uh, which I just love. Oh, I love them. They're just great. So I, I think um, definitely, I mean, the other 70s ones, um, I have got Genesis Dalek somewhere else. Where, and then um, what, Destiny of the Daleks is the only other one, isn't it, in the 70s? And they get sort of a weird pick lighter colour. Yeah, I don't know if the figures are actually an accurate representation of how light they are in the story. I mean Yeah, possibly not. Yeah. It rings a bell. I think there was isn't there one Dalek in that story that is still it's a just darker, a gr- yeah. darker grey or something. Yeah. Um, uh-huh. yeah, well, weird stuff happening there. But yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to get them the figures of them when they hopefully release them. Um, yeah. but I think I suppose we'll see when when that happens, but I think certainly personally speaking at the moment these guys are like the definitive one for the 70s really yeah um, which is weird i mean i always think it's so weird how they had day of the daleks planet of the daleks and then for death they were like right let's change oh, it course, to silver got, and black got death, but that's, yes. that's the thing though because then they change it back 
And it's sort of like, well, why, why was that done? Yeah, because they're sort of more reminiscent of these yeah. to a certain extent, I suppose. It's almost, it's almost like a perfect that. merge because you've got the black uh, for two. globes yes, and things, yes. but, but uh, that kind of thing. And then obviously you've got the, the really cool addition of the machine guns in that as well, yes. which is like so. Oh, I can't wait. Uh, I really want that to, to be. Those. I think in the pack when they do mm. it. I mean, obviously we're veering off into toy territory here, but yes, when no, they do loud. when they do the two pack, yeah. I think it should be one with the machine gun and one with mm. the black gun and you can or yes. maybe they'll do like a swappable thing where you can swap them in and out because mm, isn't there a because... thing where like one of them has like, a black mid section and one of them doesn't or something weird like that I think there is a might there's like and, a, a, and a one of them has the red dome lights and the rest are all clear right um, okay yes and when they released the sound effects one they did the clear dome lights and the gun uh-huh. But the gun was silver instead of black. Oh, there's that as well. So there? yes. uh, there's that little little thing All as well. Of, uh, yeah, of but complications. The, but I think that would be so cool if they did um, a machine gun Dalek mm. and you could swap it over with the normal oh, gun. Amazing. But but like Fingers that crossed. like that looked so good. Those Daleks looked amazing. Mm. So I don't know why they went. Well, let's go back to and because you'd think for Genesis as well, so surely a silver design is closer to these ones. So yeah, it's true, isn't it? Yeah. I guess. Yeah, I don't know. It's, I, I just don't know what the thought like process that, sort of that was. Dark greys and moody Nazi type. I don't know, like like Gestapo. Just, yeah. yeah, horrible colours. Like yeah, if dull colours. They, they know, blend in, don't they? Yeah. I suppose so. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I mean, yeah. Uh, like I say, I don't know the figures of those guys. Yeah, the Death and the Destiny ones. I mean, they're nice, like one-off um, designs, I suppose, and, and certainly they. Once I have got them, they will look you know, complement yeah. the rest quite nicely. Well, speaking of one-off um, designs as well, for Planet mm. of the Daleks, we didn't just get these guys. Of course. Got, um, um, after, like, five episodes worth of waiting, the, the yeah, Supreme. Yeah, I think he's only in, like, one episode. I think, is it part six of the cliffhanger to part five? Or yeah, something like that? I think, yeah so you're it's, right. It's, uh, it's a very, very small very appearance. On, yeah. And it's basically a, a movie Dalek, isn't it? But from the second film. Yeah, um, something like that. Yeah. They repaint something it. Like that, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And it's got different lights and stuff, and yeah, yeah, jam jars, yes, yeah, um, and a torch for the eye as well. Yes, different eyes, yeah, of course, yes, yeah. Oh, again, that's one that I just can't. Please, I, I really hope they're going to re-release that. Lovely, yeah, because um, I'd love to put it alongside my Mechanist Starlet. Like, yeah, just the two side by side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I really want that. That'd be so nice. Please, help. please, help. please, please, help. Help. Yeah. Um, Anyway, yeah. so that's the seventies, I guess. Eighties. Um, what have we got in the eighties? We've got three, haven't we? So we've got the the Supreme from Resurrection. Yes, um, which I mean. I always loved that it's great, stark it? design. It's so oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, I recently got hold of that, plus a drone Dalek. Um, from, I think, oh, our, our Space Customs, I think it was on Instagram. Right. Hayden, uh, shout out there. But, um, yeah, thanks so much for those, because they're amazing. Uh, I, I agree, like... I hadn't quite realised until I saw this in person. It's so striking. Stark, yeah, it's striking. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. great, isn't it? And obviously, like in the show, they put the um, like the skirt section the opposite way around, didn't they, or something. Yeah, there was something weird, like or I yeah. think it was like I think that's what it was. The cause... Madame Two Swords Dalek, or something, which was made <laughs> separate to all the other ones. Yeah, because I think the the official like the figurine Eagle Moss figurine of of this dude does have that where like that the weird, skirt is skirt, the other way yeah. around, and it's yeah. Yeah, and they they had like <laughs> the eighties ones had like little little black rod coming at the top of their heads sometimes. Oh, I don't know yeah. what was, what that yeah. is. Yeah, yeah. I mean, mm. at least the Eagle Moss figures have that. And I don't know why. Yeah, <laughs> it, was, it was like a manufacturing error. Like yes, but, um, yes. Oh, but yeah, no, I history. loved that. I mm. always loved that Supreme. And um, when they released the Toys R Us two packs, and I was like, mm. "Oh, for the fifth Doctor one, please, can they do like fifth Doctor in there?" Oh, right. But they yes. didn't. No, and I was like, "Damn it!" But the still the the one that comes in the there, one did, with yes. the red dome oh, lights and things. It looks like jealous. a five Doctor Dalek. <laughs> it's great. Yes. Um, oh, so yeah, that's. Mm. It's 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 such a nice version of the Supreme, and we didn't talk about like for these the uh, the Supreme is often sure, that black, yeah, the black kind of, um, yeah, yeah, like as early as what dark invasion of Earth and stuff, isn't it? Like yeah. I love the Master Plan, Master Plan, uh, yeah, Supreme, of course, it's yeah. great, so oh, cool. Yes. But that's mm. uh, those Supremes go. That's a really good. One. Yeah, well, I was gonna say which which Supreme over the over the years do you think of all the, the all the Dalek Supremes I mean the the Stolen Earth one is hard to it is well, for yeah. nostalgia it's hard to beat I remember seeing that in Doctor Adventures the week before 
It's like, oh my god, a red Dalek. And it's yeah. Like, wow. Yeah, that was the first time we'd seen that kind of thing for yeah, like our generation. And all these different like bulky bits. They yeah. In front of it and a different shape. That oh, just and the amazing, remote control it? version. When I got that, yeah. it was just so nice. It was great. It's a great Dalek. You know what? I pro- probably should, probably would be that mm-hmm. one because it's got all the because it looks like. Um, it's not just oh he's just painted a different colour it's like yes. no he's got these extra it's, bits on him and, yeah, and more lights and things yeah no, it's one of those ones like if you look at it like particularly the figure if you like look at it for like too long or whatever you think oh, God, this is such a unique design and it's yeah. so different in terms of all these different like bits. built up sections and bits yeah. and stuff yeah it's uh, it's a real real departure from uh, just the standard design yeah. it's all the better for it it's, it's I mean, so nice. yeah, it's got to be that one, really. Yeah, I think uh, so. Close contender is the Planet Supreme, Planet. yeah, I and think. the Doctor Who and the Daleks movie. Uh, Supreme. Okay, the, yes. the black Dalek black and one. that. I just can't yeah. get over the alternating like yes. globes yeah. and and the, <laughs> the gold eye stalk and things. I mean, just looking at that packaging, yeah, like, it's, it's, it's just back in. so cool. It's just amazing. Yeah, I love it. Um, so that's that's definitely one for mm. for the Supremes. Absolutely. Um, but yeah, and then the Daleks and that they had that new eye stalk as well, which I really love the co- the the conical yes, eye yes. stalk. That's the same as that one, right? Is it? Yeah, they yeah. All, in that story, they all had that, and then they go back on it. Back so on it yeah. Again, because again, that's something that I I didn't realize until I got the figures. Yeah. That, um, how what a difference that sort of stuff makes. Yeah. Um, yeah. Really, it's just, really it's just nice. something so different. I mm. don't know uh, why, but it just looks like a sort of antennae like. Um, receiver thing or something like that the way it's mm. built it's great um and again i don't know why for revelation they just go back to the bog standard stuff you wonder why what decisions were made yeah and revelation's a weird one as well because like it's, it's the um like the sort of imperial but the white and gold ones they have like a weird gap don't they like yeah in the underneath neck, the neck yeah. Or something. yeah like an extra layer that doesn't quite align finish off whatever yeah. they are it's, it's a weird one i mean the yeah i mean if we're talking about the imperial guys i think these the remembrance yeah, one yeah, yeah they always um, win out is where it's at i mean this isn't an accurate sort of sculpt sorry but uh it, it does the job Cause, like, because they were, they were taller, taller and thinner i think yeah. like something like that um i kind of like the uniformity so nice. of it it's not yeah. It's not, it goes for all my, my my like O C D yeah, just sitting all the same same looks, size. Yeah. Just, apart from this guy, the little chunky head. Yeah, but yeah, so, yeah. Yeah. we'll forgive that. Yeah. For um, that feature. I don't want to know. Yeah, but I mean, certainly in terms of the we had the, the the drones like this as well. So is that one from the Remembrance? The Remembrance, one, the Renegade. The then, Renegades um, um, from the the four pack. From the four yeah. pack, yeah. Uh, courtesy of Mestor Magnificent, of course. Uh, in fact, I think uh, I don't know about yeah, just that one as the. Imperials, the Cold yeah. School one. Um, yeah, it looks so tiny on that that figure. I know, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> it's very it's short. Small, yeah. But um, it makes it look the mm. proportions of the episode, I suppose, doesn't it? Yes, I, I'm just thinking because there are minor differences with that and the Revelation and Resurrection drones, aren't there? Here we go. Oh right, oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, you got both in there. Yeah, like that one. In terms of colour scheme, it was so it goes. I mean, they're, they're all di- different variations of grey, aren't they? Diff- yeah, and little. I mean, I suppose what the the base and the mid sections are mostly uniform, aren't they? It's just the eye stalks and yeah, the, well, it's pieces like that. These no, the oval, the oval, oval is painted. Black oval as well, yeah. yeah. Um, which the remembrance one doesn't have. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see. I did like the. Um, the blue tint of um, mm. these guys because that's the yeah that's the original one and the Toys R Us one was even more was like, it because um, I, I thought think, that one I, I, like yeah that. I think it's like an even more vibrant um, blue tinge to that one yeah yeah and the orange lights wasn't as well yeah oh it's such yeah. a good figure Richard, it's such a good figure <laughs> one <Sorry>. day re-release <laughs> I think that's the only figure oh and the, and the Davison from that set I think that's the mm. only figure that I own that you don't oh right yeah I think yeah I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, but yes yeah it's weird see I, I mm. didn't realise how many differences there were between those it's, it's bonkers isn't those it? yeah. three when you see them all together I mean yeah cause in terms of like the other companion to the other drones as well I think um, I do think the 60s and 70s ones hold up better I, I mean yeah there's a, these there's a, there's a notion with certain... these that they're just sort of slapdash like oh we'll get yeah. whatever's in storage and I mean, if you think about like your sort of uh, stereotypical Dalek, or like your, what comes to mind if you, if you think Dalek, I suppose like these guys did get a lot of use 
like in the eighties and afterwards as well, like stuff like you know, Curse of Fatal Death. It, it's it's that sort of design, isn't it? That, yeah. Um, yeah. That I, I guess penetrates the public consciousness at that time. Um, but yeah, yeah. I, I, I think yeah, it's it's an interesting one. I mean, used um, from nineteen seventy two to to eighty nine. How well, how long is that? It's not a bad innings, is it? Yeah. yeah it's, uh, it's longer. Is it, the bronze star, like. Yeah, well, I mean, it, exactly. Like it's weird to think if you think of it, like yeah, like you, you, you just if you think of the grey Daleks under one umbrella from from all that length of time, it's uh, yeah, it's a long time, isn't it? Seventeen years. I just worked out. Right? So how long have we had the bronze <laughs> Daleks for? Um, Seventeen years. Yes. So yeah. the bron- the bronze ones might. So. Yeah. 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 Speaking of the Bronze Boys, um, we, we've spoken a lot about these guys on the channel yeah. before. I mean, how, how have you done a one eighty? Because you got to a point where you were sick of them. Yeah. Um, but I, I can't remember when we did our you you the Daleks one. You were like, oh, I had actually. them a, a, a bit. Yeah. I I um they could have done more with them in recent years, like painting them, like Revolution of the Daleks, Take Me to Your Leader. That they, they should have done. Something oh yeah, now. that was the biggest letdown um, in history. But even so, Literally. like I, I guess when you're at a point like any of the Daleks where you've got like. A different attachment on this side and on that side like to be fair they're, they're, they're doing something like it's a minor thing but they're, they're doing something um it is a case of if it ain't broke you know i like, guess so isn't it yeah they are so well designed mm. like so sturdy uh again the bigger dome lights like the movie one just the way it looks it looks like a it's war really tank, nice, you know yes. which works really well when they get the iron sides and they're yes of course you know, yeah the iron sides great so Oh, I love those And guys. it just blends so well. It's yeah. like, finally, the kind of Art Deco thing is mixed with the sort of wall aesthetic. It just... Yeah. I don't think that they ever sort of put a foot wrong with them, really. Mm. And they've never... The good thing about these bronze ones is that they've never, ever looked shoddy uh, that I can think of. Yeah, I, I suppose. Mean, can you I think mean... of anything, then? Slightly the like well or like in photos and stuff. Maybe I mean, these days, I mean, you think perhaps of, less on screen. I suppose. Yeah, on on screen, I think on screen they're, they're, they're always been standout. Uh-huh. But again, yeah. again, when you see them in person, then oh yeah, you know, <laughs> like yeah. at exhibitions or whatever, yeah. or in the foyer of wherever. It is one of the demo- the definitive. Yeah. Percent, I, I, I yeah I think so. Sort of these two really. I was sub jumping ahead of it, but I, I yeah. guess that is it, isn't it? Really? Yeah, well, yeah, it's, yeah. It's hysteric. It's a cliche dancer, but I guess. You it know. looks so nice next to each other. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like those two and a paradigm, maybe. Um, well, I mean, <laughs> speaking of paradigm, speaking of obviously paradigm. they didn't knock the bronze mm. Daleks. Well, that was no. the idea, and then it was a backtrack. Backtrack, yeah. wasn't it? And ever since we've only really had like one-off designs, where they've they've been too cautious to do anything. Anything more than that, really. I mean, um, yeah, just off the cuff. What are your thoughts on the paradigm? Pat, see, at the time, I was perfect age because I absolutely mm. loved the fact that collect them all, you know, uh-huh. there's, there's all five of them. Mm. Um, I think looking back now, like watching Victory of the Daleks again, I just think it's so bizarre because you're like, here is them clearly rolling out the new design and it mm. never, never happened. Um, yeah, it's almost it's like they're shame, setting up it? something that it never is. even it's like gets you get addressed. them in Pandora opens very briefly for the cliffhanger, mm. but then and you, like other media as well, like the the only good Dalek graphic novel, the adventure yeah. game, and yeah, like, they were they were everywhere in two thousand ten. They were on all the merchandise and stuff. So it, it's just it's a shame, I think. Um, yeah, it's a shame they didn't they didn't, didn't commit with them. Yeah, exactly. Because like, I think they could have been very big. Hmm. Um, I mean, they were very big, they were massive. They were, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, and I think what they did with the metallic thing was really good as well. It's a shame mm. they didn't kind of go, oh yeah, this this makes them a bit more palatable. Let's go. With yeah, that. I because they are a bit too Power Rangers in the in the Victory of the Daleks. <laughs> it's like, um, yeah, especially the scientist. That orange looks so bright and not in a kind of movie way of like, oh how color. <laughs> it's like, oh okay, color. yeah. Um, <laughs> It, it just makes them look a bit... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but mm-hmm. for some reason it just didn't work. And that's okay, but... Yeah. I always find it weird how the gun was so bloody huge as well. Yeah, it's like as long as the... Uh, as the long as the plunger, isn't it? yeah. It's bonkers. massive. Yeah. And they, they had this big sort of mantelpiece on the front of them <laughs> as well. Um, yeah. There was lots of... It is interesting design. And what was this... Mm. Um, What's oh, that all about? Yeah, so I think there was like some concept art for that Did possibly it? appeared online or? in a book or whatever. Um, where in the show that I 
think this bit was like a fold down, like concertina or whatever, this right. little grey bit. And then a weapon, like different appendage would like swing out and then it would move along this like indent here, inside here. And then it would, like, yeah. it would replace the, uh, like the plunger or whatever. That like would move along that inside bit and then be swapped out for... For wow. a different thing. Yeah. Well, there we go. <laughs> um, I'm not surprised they didn't mm. do that because that sounds really hard to CGI. It would have been a nightmare, wouldn't it? But yeah. Um, I, I still think with these guys that, you know, one day they deserve another chance. Like, obviously, Big Finish haven't got their hands on them yet, I don't think. Um, is the Matt Smith era not within the... No, it is. Yeah, because they've done like mm. loads of stuff with the bronze guys. So you know, yeah. hopefully one day they can start appearing on covers. And I still think as well... <sighs> I don't know, maybe on TV again one day. Like, if it, if enough time had passed for it to be like a nostalgic thing, where they're like, oh, we're going to yes, bring back yeah, yeah. the bronze Daleks, in the same way they sort of brought back the Mondasian Sidemen or whatever. Um, I, I, I can see Russell maybe. Well, I don't know. Maybe or, not. Or maybe so not. Soon, maybe not but... like for a, an episode, but like for an event, like a yeah, a proms or something. Oh, like that. Yeah, I can, yeah, I can yeah, imagine them being rolled out and scaring. Mm fans and things like that yeah it'd be nice um, but you're right there's a lot of things that untapped potential the eternal mm. as well what was that the eternal about? we'll never know <sighs> who knows yeah 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 no so i think they've got their merits but they obviously like, can, the fact, the fact that they didn't, it didn't work i suppose yeah. can't you but yeah yeah i can see what they were yeah, going I for did. but you can mm. see why it didn't work as well mm. um and what's also interesting is because height-wise, they're the same height as Matt Smith because they've had to get his eye line. Yeah, they always do this, and, don't they? And height-wise height, height for the bronze ones, they're, they're the same height as Billy mm. Piper. Yeah. It's just so weird how... The, but like the consistent now is is these bronze ones, so they're constantly going to be Billy's height. Yes. It's just weird, <laughs> Billy isn't Piper it? Daleks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, mm. But uh, obviously, I mean, I don't know whether that, they would have been that height anyway. It's just a coincidence, maybe. I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't know. Um, but I remember seeing, like, they used the original classic bases or something like that, maybe. I don't know why I've seen pictures of them when they were building these bronze ones and they had the... Oh, okay, okay yeah. I don't know like whether they used guys. the same sculpts right, and things like yeah. that. I'm not sure. Something like that. Yeah, maybe just altered the globes and things. But yeah. yeah. Uh, but Paradigm was, Paradigm, yeah. yeah. And then, obviously, after that, we, we had the weird period where well obviously we had a lot of stuff like Asylum of the Daleks where it's like a free for all yeah um, yeah. oh you, do you remember that when they advertised I do the remember whole... being really, really hyped for that yeah, yeah and they they did nothing <laughs> Rory just <laughs> like ran the, past the uh, pull out poster time. in the Radio Times where yeah. it had like all them on and... yeah most depressing thing was when they were like they had that scene of all the Daleks who'd gone mad because they'd met the Doctor from like Exelon and and uh, you know, Iridius <laughs> and things like that, and, and they're the just bronze, bronze ones. ones. Yeah. It just doesn't make any sense. And it's like you've got the prop. Like there's no, there's not even an excuse. It's not even like oh, well, they're all bronze Daleks now. Mm. It's like you've got the props there. It's just so so weird. Yeah, um, it's a weird one. They rectified it in so. the Magician's Apprentice. I yeah, suppose. I think so. Uh, which was lovely. Uh, it, it kind of gets that weird point. So I, I I guess maybe um, obviously they don't use the paradigm after Asylum and stuff. I, I guess. It was, was the time of the last appearance? I think, yeah, I think so. Because they kind of went... Like a Radio Times cover for Time of the Doctor that they were on. Ye- oh, 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 yeah. It's mm. like it's like Matt, and he's like looking down, looking very menacing. Yeah. Well, and it I looks like it's been me. taken with a flash. It's like a really... Yes, like that's right, yeah, 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 yeah. That's um, weird, isn't it? Why did they mm. have that? Who knows? Yeah, who knows? I mean, whatever was in the stock cover, probably. But because um... they, they basically they started off in in the sense of like, oh, this is the new race of Daleks. Yeah. They go off. They come back in Pandora Opens and it's just them. So it's like, all right, this is their own thing. And then in Asylum, they're they're like the leader class almost, aren't they? You've got yes. the, the Supreme does the talking yes. and then the bronze ones are there. And then you've got these guys like guarding mm. people. Um, I, mean, I guess as well, it doesn't help does it, that we had obviously Day of the Doctor, which required Time War Daleks. Yes, yeah. And that, that almost that was, was nailed in the coffin that was like, right, well, we don't yeah, need these anymore. There's no way they could fit into that. And then yeah. I guess as well, just with... Like, it would have been interesting to see them with Peter Capaldi, I suppose, but at the same time, I can kind of see why they went down the route of keeping these guys and obviously bringing back the legacy, like the Scaro Daleks and stuff, because that's just irresistible, because it's Peter Capaldi, he's a big classic fanboy, like, yeah. you know. I mean, there are loads of opinions on, on what they did with these, like the are in the back for Mission's Prince and stuff. I mean, I, I quite liked it myself. Yeah. Um... I like how oh, yeah. in that episode as well, like in another callback to the 60s, he wore the check trousers like half. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. 
Amazing, isn't it? So, um, yeah. yeah, the Capaldi era is a weird one for the Dalek. And then, obviously, you know, more recently, we've just had these one-off designs. I mean, I suppose Rusty is a one-off design to some extent as well. But mm. then the the Recon Dalek, uh, which we've got here. And then the uh, the Defence Drones, which they still haven't made yet. Character got on it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> hopefully one day, fingers crossed. I'm guessing you're a fan of them. The Defence Drones. Yeah. Or you just, you just so, want yeah. them for the well, fact that it's a figure of... Well, both, I suppose, yeah. yeah. I think that what the, the recon one was interesting because mm. they obviously very clearly stated, like, oh, this is a unique Dalek. Sure, this yeah. isn't, you know. And then obviously the, def- the defense drones was another thing. It was like, these have been manufactured on Earth mm. based off this. So n- neither on neither occasions were they like, here's the new Dalek design. Exactly, yeah. It was just, like, here's another Dalek design. You kind of know design. from the start yeah. there that it's not going to be the, yeah, the, the new one. Then it's not replacing yeah. anything, I suppose. They've, and then, they've been quite cautious in yeah. that sense. And then you yeah. get to, obviously, Eve of the Daleks. Yeah. Oh, sorry, yeah. I'm forgetting all the titles. <laughs> and Flux as well, that's uh, it. And Flux. Very, yeah. very briefly. When you get the, the yeah. CGI Daleks. Um, yes. Flying across. Yeah. Mm. So um, it's obviously... Stop footage. Yeah. It, the bronze ones are, are the they're back. Are, on, they're yeah. still there. They're still kicking around. Still around. Uh, and they're going to be in the centenary, aren't they? They are with the plungers again, isn't it? And um, with the pl- was it? I, yeah. I can't oh yeah, yeah. Great. Um, yeah, That's with the plungers back and just yeah. just back as they were. So I, I guess you know. I mean, we've discussed this so many times, but I, I suppose that will be there. Swan song. That's one song. It would make sense. Yes, because then we said that about the Daleks as well. But. It's bad wolf. And then again, mm. I mean, they're using Jody's Tardis prop, so it's not like they're That's adverse to not, just starting from scratch. Of, is it? No, no. <laughs> yeah. Someone said um, that they were selling a lot of stuff from Roth Lock, like oh, like props, props and, and stuff. Things. I've seen bits of this on eBay. I think. Yeah. Like um, there was the the medicine sign from Village of the Angels that was up for sale. Then what? Like you know the village medicine. Where it was set. Medicine? Medicine. Oh, Medicine. I was like, what? <laughs> okay, right, Medicine. Yeah. Oh, like the there village was... sign. Right, okay. So, uh, yeah. I thought you were talking about like a doctor's surgery poster, like in the background, medicine. like some set dressing. No, no, I was no. like, cool. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and like um, one of, like, it was, can you hear me? The um, Zalin, the, the god guy with the fingers. What? He one his of, fingers? One of his fingers was for oh. sale. <laughs> and there's been other stuff as well. Oh, God, what else have I seen? I'm sure I've seen some other stuff. I need to go on eBay. And it's been like um, Kablam, like yeah. No, I've seen so many Kablam. Bits and pieces. But it's some so... of that was from Time Fracture, possibly as well, maybe. Because oh, yeah. they, they have some there. Uh, it's funny. Yeah. I, I was talking to some of the people at Time Fracture, and they yeah. said the amount of times they've gone on eBay and found stuff from the Black Archive there that people um, have just gone no. in and nicked, ah. and they've had to go. Excuse, they have to contact them and go, excuse me. Yeah. You know. But whether there'll be anything, any of that's going to be going anywhere. But what's yeah. funny about the Kablam thing, I know yes. we're totally going off track yeah, for a yeah. dark video, but um, I bought, I was cleaning my bathroom at uni and I, this is, sounds so boring. <laughs> I bought a little, a little uh, like um, bleach thing from Wilco. And then someone showed a picture of the Kablam stuff that they'd got. I can't remember the name. I think it's Doc Who Pages. And uh-huh. the Kablam cleaning product bottle is the exact same one from no. Wilco. So obviously someone just went to Wilco, got the <laughs> thing and stuck a little Kablam thing on the front. Oh my God. But I just I'm love how much that look probably would have cost as well. Oh yeah. Um, just for the sake of the uh, sticker. This is the thing, isn't it? Like, yeah. Like... So I've got a Kablam, uh, yeah. a Kablam bottle. <laughs> official official, yeah, official merch. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I would like to get a Kablam wow. box though. That'd be pretty cool. Mm. Yeah. I mean, it's a hole in the rabbit hole, isn't it? But maybe. it is. It is. <laughs> one day, maybe. one day one we're gonna day. have a prop, full size Dalek here yeah, in, in the, the middle. middle. Just be here, like a Dalek head, time. Dalek eye stalk, yeah. or Dalek gun. Up slowly. Yeah, I'd love a gun from uh, Daleks in Manhattan. Oh yeah, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. I mean, as a champion of that story, I'd love. Of course. Yes. Anyway, yes. Going back to Daleks. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, we basically covered everything. I mean, yeah, I should not name mention that story. I suppose like Dalek sex, another one we haven't. Oh uh, yeah, touched on. yeah, yeah. He's I'm just trying cool. to think of any minor variants we've uh, got. Like in new, we've had things like what, like the assault Dalek, we've had the, oh, the yeah, Emperor, the assault Emperor Dalek, Guard yeah. Daleks yeah. from um, Series One, Two, Five. Like different attachments. Are lovely. Yeah, um, yeah we, we need figures of all those different uh, with the attachments and stuff. We need. That. I think that will happen when we Fingers get to crossed. Passing of the Ways. I think mm. we'll get a two pack of, um, oh, of Emperor Guard. Amazing. With the with the weapons, I wonder what they're going to do for the Dalek two pack. Yeah, and I've seen people suggest maybe like um, a dirtied it. up one, and then like and a then clean a clean one. one. Yeah, uh, that makes sense. That's that's possible. Yeah, but yeah, no, I think that's that's just just about everything, isn't it? Yeah. Um, Other than comic book stuff. 
Dalek Alpha. Other than that, I think that's all you Yeah, Dalek Alpha, yeah. Something like that recently, and it's a very, very nice figure. So nice. So nice. It's so it? good. Um, but yeah, so, so I, I guess, you know, definitive designs, it, it is the bronze and the, and the, the, the OG. Really, really, isn't it? Um, yeah, with a shout out to the grey one. Yeah, that's, that's risen at the ranks for me recently, especially since the figure came out. So, yeah, I mean, nice, personally, it's like the bronze ones will always be the definitive one for me. Mm. I think that's the best. They've just never ever been across um, I think 60 years. Yeah. Like a one that has always lingered for me is the Death of the Daleks design because I just think that okay. it's such a good combination yeah. of yeah. the 70s and the 60s. Mm-hmm. It just, it, I just don't know why they didn't go with it because it's perfect. Mm. Um, and then like a, another personal favourite is the movie Daleks. Just They just look so mm-hmm. nice. Like if I could get a full size Dalek, I'd probably get. I keep obsessing over that Supreme, but like the the, <laughs> the black and gold Supreme from that. Oh yes. Uh, or a, a drone, like yeah. that would be so nice. Oh my god. And they got given away as like competition prizes back in the day. Yes, I think one went on like a bonfire or something, didn't it? Have you heard about yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, I oh. did hear about that. Ridiculous. Uh, day. Yeah, I mean, I suppose they weren't built to last, but like no, that's true. Isn't it's it? just yeah. um, <laughs> the fact that for the second film they had none of the original props because they'd all been given away. Yeah. It's mad. Yeah. that's bonkers yeah, so. uh, but anyway let us know your favourite dark designs down there in the comments mm-hmm. um, and yeah thanks for watching thanks for watching all these collabs hopefully you've, you've watched them all uh, if you haven't you can catch them on, on both our channels yep. reviews of the Dalek movies mm-hmm. and a little uh, news update thing as well we did um, and, and no doubt we'll see you again uh, in the future for, for more stuff more over news. the summer or just whatever really um yeah, whenever there's any news or just 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 whatever. More filming. More filming. Maybe we'll More. see the Daleks out filming. You never know. That would be so nice. Yeah. Oh, that would be so so nice. A new Dalek design. New, I do hope we get a new one. Do you think? Yeah, I I, I think it's it, it's the right time with funding. Well, presumably being being in place like with you know the new era and stuff. Just hopefully. Yeah. Like if there was a time they're gonna do it, it, it would be, it'll now. be now. Yeah. So. And I trust Russell to do it as well. Mm. I think Russell would discover it. Yeah. 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 But yeah, let us know in the comments below what you'd like to see from the Daleks in the future as well, and just just, just everything really. Favorite designs and and what you'd like to see next, and uh, we will see you again at some point in the future. But for now, thank you so much for watching and exterminate. Bye. <laughs>